I think I got the courage to start Revolution Studio from a belief that was instilled with me within me at a young age. I can think back to a story my mom and I used to read, The Little Engine That Could. And in that book, he, or The Little Engine, says, like, I think I can, I think I can, I think I can. And it takes me back to a memory when I was about seven years old, the first time I asked my mom if I could ride my bike to school. And she said yes, but she wanted to come with me just to make sure I got there okay. And we came upon this one, what seemed like a massive hill at that time. And, and I started trying to pedal up that hill and you know, about halfway, I, I stopped and said, I can't do this. I, I can't make it up the hill and, you know, proceeded to probably throw my bike down and, and go into full on meltdown. And my mom said, you're the, you are the little engine, get on your bike and say out loud, I think I can, I think I can. And I did, I got back on my bike and she said, say it out loud. And I said, I think I can. And she said it again, say it again, say it again. And she made me say, I think I can, I think I can one pedal stroke at a time um, until I got to the top of that hill. And I just remember feeling so accomplished in that moment that someone stood for me not giving up on myself and seeing something through when at that time was, you know, making my way up a hill. It was that mindset that if I can make my way up this hill and I bring that to my classes and I bring that to Revolution Studio, it's like if you can make your, if you can set your mind to making your way up this hill, you can set your mind to making your business come true. And it just comes down to, I think, a sense of confidence, not knowing that you're going to get it right and not thinking that you're perfect or, you know, that um, that you've got it all figured out, but just having a belief that I think I can and putting one foot in front of the other until you actually make it happen.